of our country that um, we do not continue, you know, what was left off by the previous government, especially in the transition between my administration and Nanado's administration. I think that in previous administrations, an effort has been made to keep, you know, development going. And so I haven't seen a case where there's been such a sudden, you know, directive to stop work while government audits pro projects. Our idea is that when you're working on things like roads, when you develop it to a certain state, if you don't finish it, then what happens is it deteriorates. And when you come back to do it, it becomes even more expensive. For instance, when coming from um, Pasa down to Onkwanta, on the left side of the road, they had put what um, in road construction they call 040. That is that cement mix that you put before you put asphalt over um, the, 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 the road. And it has been left since 20. 17 and you can see that the 040 has you know deteriorated and so eventually if the contractor has asked to come back off the, on the road he'll have to take that off and you know put a new mix to uh, cover the road before he puts the asphalt that is not my money <laughs> the money that was used to do that did not come from my pocket it came from the pocket of the taxpayers and so when you recklessly you know abandoned projects like that then what you do is you waste the money of the taxpayers that's the taxes that all of us pay their schools their electric poles you know water systems i mean i've crisscrossed the country and you see them everywhere that, that have been abandoned and i think that is the tragedy you know of our development that we start and stop it's going to be a big challenge um when i come back into office and um, what i have suggested to do is that we'll start no new projects you know in the first year and what we'll do is we'll harness all the resources that are possible to continue and finish the projects that have been left abandoned like that so And you heard the former president talking about projects. Well, days after Vice President Dr. Baumia's presentation on uh, achievements by government, especially in the area of infrastructure, the debate is far from over. Today, the NDC at a press conference has been outlining what it